The Himalaya are the highest mountains on Earth. They are also one of our planet's greatest freshwater reserves in the form of glacial ice and snow. As a result of warming caused by global climate change, there is increased glacial melt. And the rate at which Himalayan glaciers are receding is compelling evidence of global climate change. Glaciers in the Tibet Autonomous Region of China, Bhutan and Nepal are receding at an alarming rate. The Imja Glacier in Nepal receded at a rate of over 70 meters per year from 2001 to 2006 one of the highest rates of retreat. And the Gangotri Glacier in northern India retreated two kilometers in the last 200 years. When glacier meltwater cannot freely flow downward, larger and new glacial lakes are formed. Bodies of water are trapped in natural dams that have walls of loose glacial moraine. The danger is that, beyond a certain threshold, these walls cannot hold in the water. The result? Glacial lake outburst floods, wreaking destruction on downstream settlements. Glacial melt also affects the fresh water flow, causing significant adverse effects on drinking water supply, agriculture, livelihood, biodiversity, as well as the environment. Of about 9,000 glacial lakes mapped in the Hindu Kush Himalaya, about 200 lakes have been identified as potentially dangerous. In Nepal and Bhutan, the Dukoshi and Pochu areas are considered two major hotspots of glacial activity. It is imperative to investigate, monitor, and assess potentially dangerous glacial lakes and glacier activity so that mitigation measures can be planned. But conventional methods are inadequate and difficult for field investigations in the often inaccessible terrain of the Himalaya. Remote sensing techniques, though, can be effective in providing early warnings of glacial lake outbursts. In this simulation of an outburst in Lake Imja in Nepal, the blue markings show the areas that will be subject to inundation and possible devastation.
Remote sensing techniques, combined with flood simulation models, can help identify and thus prevent damage to downstream communities and their infrastructures. Remote sensing using radio detection and ranging, or radar, can penetrate even cloudy atmospheric conditions so that glacial lakes and their surroundings can be monitored throughout the year. Given accelerated global warming in the high regions of the Hindu Kush Himalaya, it is vital for national and international communities to support initiatives to gain a better scientific understanding so as to take corrective measures before it is too late.